Halakala is on the Hawaiian island of Maui. It is 19 square miles total. Halakala was established July 1st, 1961. It was originally created as a part of the Hawaii National Park, along with the volcanoes of Moana Lo and Kilauea. On the island of Hawaii in 1916, Hawaii Volcanoes National Park was made into a separate national park in 1961. The park area was designated an International Biosphere Reserve in 1980. Some animals you might find on Halakala are the tarragade, the Hawaiian petrel, and honey creepers. Honey creepers are genetically related. The honey creepers physical shapes are as varied as woodpeckers and parrots. The Hawaiian petrel is estimated to have about 450 to 650 breeding pairs on Maui. The population size on Kauai have been estimated but not confirmed to be several thousand. And the tarragades are about 0 0.5 millimeters, so about 0 0.02 inches long when they are fully grown. At Halakala, walking the trails might be intense, so I'd be prepared. I'd bring a water bottle, a couple snacks, and a pair of good tailgates. Hello. One can walk or run the two most famous trails on Halakala, which are the Sliding Sands Trails and the Hala Maui Trails. You can also hike down to the crater floor of the Halakala Crater, which can be very different because the trail is descending roughly about 2,000 feet or more to the crater floor. I would be careful and make sure you are absolutely aware of your surroundings. Some plants in Halakala are the Luminous Halakala Silver Sword, the Shidea Halakalensis, and Subalpine Shrubland. The Luminous Halakala Silver Sword can live up to 90 years, and this plant came to the National Park naturally and was not brought by man. The Shidea Halakalensis this plant is a shrub that can grow up to 30 to 60 centimeters tall. The inflorence is a cluster of flowers with tiny green sepals and no petals. The subalpine shrubland is a slow-growing native shrub that captures moisture on the upper slopes of Halakala. The shrubland hosts ancient ohelo, pukaiwe, and geraniums. The remnant pockets of shady ohia and sandalwood groves. Some geological features are the summit area that includes the Halakala Crater. It is the summit of the volcano in the area surrounding the summit. The crater is huge, sitting at 6.99 miles across and 2.0 miles wide, and some 2,600 feet deep. Another feature are the Halakala's volcanoes. Halakala has produced numerous eruptions in the last 30,000 years, including in the last 500 years. This volcanic activity has been along two rift zones, the southwest and east. These two rift zones together form an arc that extends from La Perouse Bay on the southwest through the Halakala Crater and to the Hana to the east. Some fun things that you can do are walk or run the two most famous trails on Halakala, which are the Sliding Sands Trails and the Hala Maui Trails. You can also hike down to the crater floor of the Halakala Crater, which can be very difficult because the trail is descending roughly about 2,000 feet or more to the crater floor. You might also go and explore the famous volcanoes of Halakala. See you soon!